Survivor's ready. Go! Big learning curve out of the gate. Takes a lot of touch. You only get that touch by practicing again and again. Gonna drop that ball a lot in the beginning. Don't let that worry you. Don't get frustrated. Just keep going. Missy doing a nice job. Baylor doing a nice job. Keith drops. Jacqueline's still at the front, trying to figure out how to get that ball moving. Missy getting some momentum now. Keith drops again. Keith had an advantage in this challenge. The question is, did it help? You don't want to panic in this challenge because anything can happen. Missy drops, she's got to go back. Just when you think you have it figured out, you lose your ball and you got to start again. Baylor halfway through with her first ball, if she can keep it alive. Baylor drops, she's got to start over. Keith working on his first ball. Keith with a nice save. Keith now starting to make some progress. Keith doing a nice job. He's got his ball on the final obstacle. Keith very close. If he can get it up top and drop, it gets very tricky at the end. Keith has his first ball through, two to go. There are three balls total you have to transfer. Keith has one. Everybody else still trying to figure it out. Jacqueline trying to get a key. She's looking over at Keith. What is he doing? What does he know that I don't know? Is that advantage helping Keith? It would appear so. Jacqueline still working at the first obstacle. Keith, whip it through this course. Keith working that second ball. Oh my God. Keith very close to having a second ball. Keith has his second ball. One left for Keith. Natalie's still trying to get one. Baylor drops again. She's got to start over. Jacqueline drops again. She's got to start over. Missy's still working on that first ball. I'm dropping them. Keith working on that third ball. Nobody else even close yet. Natalie's starting to panic now, rushing. That's not going to help. Baylor rushing now, trying to put some pressure on Keith. Keith getting very close to finishing this challenge. He's got his third ball on the final obstacle. Can he keep it steady? It would be his third individual immunity, guaranteeing him a spot in the final four. Individual immunity, guaranteed a spot in the final four. All right, here we go. Four immunity, guaranteed spot in the final four. Survivors ready? Go. Definitely a learning curve to this challenge. They're going to be dropping balls and starting over. That's part of it. Sarah working on that first transition. She's got it. Culpepper makes that first transition. Ties through his first obstacle. Sarah's through that second obstacle. Culpepper working around that second obstacle. Ty now heading for the second obstacle. Ty drops. He's got to go back. Sarah navigates that third obstacle. Culpepper right at the third obstacle. Aubrey and Troy's hand struggling to get out of the gate. What the hell? Culpepper nearing that final obstacle. Sarah right behind him. Is Culpepper and Sarah at the same spot in the challenge? Culpepper makes the final transition. Sarah does not. Sarah has to go back. Culpepper now very close to the finish with his first ball. Culpepper drops and has his first of three balls. Culpepper now knows it is possible. He can do it. Ty, Aubrey, Troyzan trying to get something going. Aubrey having no luck at all. Sarah now at the third obstacle. Culpepper now at the third obstacle, but he's on his second ball. 
Culpepper navigates it, now heading into that final obstacle. Sarah still sitting on that third obstacle. Ball really moving, and it drops. Sarah once again loses all of her progress, has to begin again. Culpepper very close to finishing his second ball. Culpepper has his second ball, one ball left for immunity. It would be Culpepper's fourth individual immunity win and would put him within striking distance of the survivor record, which is five, held by a very small and elite group. Troyzan at the fourth and final obstacle. He's got to move. Troyzan drops. All progress lost, has to start again. Nobody else even close. Culpepper working his way up that final obstacle. Aubrey just gonna watch now. It would be a dominating fourth individual immunity win within one of the record. Culpepper wins his fourth individual immunity, guaranteed a spot in the final four.